What's up, family? Send your cigar here. You are wherever you are. Hopefully, staying safe and healthy and all of that. It is Wednesday. It is hump day, bay, bay. Time for the New York CNS Virtual Hearth. Um, a little me time before the workflow. I'm in Lower Manhattan, Soho, Father Fagan Park. Working the evening shift tonight. So here I am putting some smoke in the air with this uh, La Polina Black Label Maduro Gordo. It is a six by 60. And uh, and you know, when I'm chilling in the park, putting some smoke in the air, you know, senor's got to do that diet, mountain, do. Here's to ya. Oh, and I must tell you, on a day like today, it is so needed. It is a warm one. This fifth day of July, the day after the holiday. I mean, it is. Well, and you're saying, Senor, you got long sleeves on. Well, because when I go to work tonight, I work in the radio station, we have to keep the rooms cool, you know, for the equipment. And it is freezing up in that mug. So, yeah, I'm wearing the long sleeves. I'll take the heat right now. But when I get upstairs in the office, press those buttons, drive those levels, and do what I do, I'm going to be very comfortable because I got my sleeves on. So fam, I know many of you may have had Monday and Tuesday off, but for many of you, you may be starting your week, brand new week, another chance to do great things. I don't want to wish everybody a productive and profitable week for those who are just starting there. And short week, too, damn golden. Don't go it. God damn it. <laughs> It's a short week for some of you mofos. God bless you. But for those of you that had to work the holiday, I know what it's all about, that holiday pay. Yeah. But uh, as for today, well, wherever you are in your day, I hope that you're having a good day and that the rest of your day goes swimmingly well. So, fam, let me tell you, as I sit back, relax. Ah. Let's do what we do, because that's what we do, all right? Shout out to the medical professionals, first responders, EMS workers, police and fire, postal workers, MTA workers, delivery people, truck drivers going across the country, the mom and shop, pop shop owners, the laundromat owners, the bodega shop owners, anybody who has considered or deemed essential personnel during the pandemic and beyond, thank you for what you've been doing. Thank you for taking chances with your own health and safety for the health and safety of all of us in this city, in the state, in and around this country. What you have been doing, so greatly appreciated. Saying thank you is not enough. Thought I hit the microphone. Uh, saying thank you is not enough, but we do start out by saying thank you for everything you have been doing during the duration of the pandemic and beyond. And of course, you know I'm going to remind you to check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they're not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. So please get in touch with them any way you can, whether it's through a phone call, a text message, social media, video chat, Zoom, house party, Google Duo, FaceTime, Skype, and remind the people within your circle of friends to do that very same thing. Get in touch with their elders and their family and friends who live alone. No one needs to be alone at this particular time in our lives. Absolutely no one. So take the time, make the time, reach out to them, find out how they're doing, see if they need anything, see if there's anything you can do for them. If this is someone you profess to love, then this should not be a problem, Sam, because it is all about support. And while we talk about support, let us not forget all those fabulous people, those great ladies and gentlemen that own those fine cigar shops and lounges in the tri-state area. 
they need our support now more than ever as well. Whether it's a shop where you can come in, make that purchase, grab and go, or maybe it's a lounge with comfortable seating where you can come in, make that purchase, find a spot to plop, sit back, relax, light up, put some smoke in the air like so. Watch this now. Maybe a pair that fine tobacco product with your drink of choice, whether it be an adult beverage or a soft drink. Once again, your choice. Hot out here. Head take a swig. Maybe even have a conversation with another brother or sister of the leaf. But please understand, none of that can be done unless you make the effort to go to that mom and pop shop. So, what is it that you're going to do? You're going to break open the piggy bank. Fellas, open up that wallet, blow the dust out, pull out some dollar dollar bills, y'all, and then make your way to that mom and pop shop. Whether you're driving or you're going to let somebody do the driving for you, Uber or Lyft, get on the bus or the subway, Maybe a bicycle or your e-bike or your moped or your motorcycle or a pogo stick or a skateboard or roller skates. Yes, I said roller skates. And make your way to that mom and pop shop. And once you get there, you walk right in, say hello to the fine tobacconist behind the counter because they will help you with your selection and the purchase. Then walk right into that humidor. Take a stroll, see what's on the shelves, make your selections, and proudly step up to that cash register and make it rain, baby. Make it rain. Spend a few dollars to keep the cash register ringing and the doors open because it is all about support. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. Hashtag support Black business, hashtag support Latino business, hashtag support Asian business, hashtag support small business. Family, we are all in this together and we need each other now more than ever and it is the right thing to do. So once again, take the time, make the time, go out to that mom and pop shop, that great cigar shop or lounge in the tri-state area and show your support. All right. Now, fam, for many of you, like I said, first day back to work, but it's the end of your day. So what's the plan for tonight? Maybe a nice romantic dinner with your significant other. That's always nice. Maybe you're uh, going to go hang out at a bar with some friends and throw some back and pound some down. Maybe you're going to go to that mom and pop shop, that great cigar lounge, and put some smoke in the air with some brothers and sisters of the leaf. Maybe you got tickets to see a movie or a Broadway show or a concert or a comedy show. Maybe you got tickets for the big ball yard in the South Bronx. Maybe you said, you know what? Feeling kind of frisky. Want to go sing a little karaoke, family, whatever you got planned for tonight. Just make sure that a part of that plan is staying safe. Yes, they claim the pandemic is over, but you know, coronavirus is here. Not going anywhere. So you have to do everything within your power to make sure you do not contract COVID-19. And a part of staying safe and healthy, staying hydrated. Whenever you go out, have that bottle of water, that lemonade, or that iced tea, or whatever you need to stay refreshed and hydrated. Once again, it's one of them days. Got to do it. Goes down good. Family, that is a bit of advice taken from Senor Cigar. You will thank me later that you took that advice. All right? So please, have a plan to stay safe. All right? All right. So, um, uh, hmm. can't get enough of this La Polina. Black Label Maduro Gordo, this 6x60. Love it. 
Shout out to William C. Paley and everybody at La Polina Cigars. Um, they own a piece of property in Midtown. If you ever heard of Paley Park on East 53rd Street, they're uh, connected to that establishment as well. A nice little private park. We're putting some smoke in the air is allowed and encouraged. All right. So fam, I am going to wrap this up for today so I can get on with my business. Press those, get upstairs to press those buttons, ride those levels and do what I do. But please do not forget, check in on the elders of your family, your family and friends who live alone. They need to hear from you. They need to know that they are not alone. They need to know that someone loves them. They need to know that together we're getting through this. We're going to get through this. We're going to be all right. Hashtag support mom and pop shops. Hashtag support small business. And if you're going out tonight, tomorrow night, this weekend, any night moving forward, make sure that you got a plan to stay safe so you can stay healthy, so you can stay alive. That is it. That is all I got. I am that man, Senor Cigar, enjoying my fine tobacco product. Hop in my collar because I can. And as always, I want to wish you long ashes. Man, better days. Everybody, enjoy the rest of your Wednesday. You know you got to get over that hump. And at some point, I do hope you'll be able to put some smoke in the air. You know. Love you like a fat kid loves cake. I hope to talk to you again real soon. But in the meantime, holler if you hear me. Yeah, baby.